Christy, I'm sorry I'm running a few minutes late. Wait, That's where are you okay. at? How are you? I'm excellent. Turn on your camera okay, so I can see, see your lovely face. Okay, you try. There we go. Oh my God. How are you? I'm so excited. I know, me too. Oh, I'm okay. Just, I just want to let you know real quick. I am digging the whole aesthetic. Like your room looks like you. Thank like you. if I was yes, going, yeah. uh, thank you. Yeah. I, uh, the, the eye, the goal. I love simple gold that yeah. The whole nine yards. So let me turn on my spirit box. Okay. I love it when my people, when they match their aesthetic, it's just like a whole thing. It's very, it's very Libra. I'd like to look at your chart later on. I want to see where all your Virgo is. Maybe that's what makes it like that. Um, okay. which is interesting. So let me vibe. Hold on. Let me feel. Uh, it's interesting. Um, I, Oh, man, I don't think this is you. Uh, well, I mean, I know this is you, but there was somebody with me earlier, like before I started sessions and I was thinking maybe it was you and I don't think it is anymore. Um, maybe. Oh. Hmm. Do you have now, like I said, I don't know if this is you. Um, this may be another session, but it just got brought up right now again. And I don't know, maybe it's a person after you, but is one of... I don't know if this is your parents. Okay. There is a feeling of somebody being maybe a, I want to say a hoarder, but like a clutter bug. Like was one of your, or like, who's the clutter bug? Like, yeah. who is that? I have in-laws. You have a lot of, I guess, a stuff ton. from a, ton. Okay. a lot. Yeah. They're worried about them. Um, I am too. You are. Okay. Okay. Oh my God. Okay. Let me tell you what was going on just now. So, okay. uh, why I was like, well, maybe this is you and maybe it's not. Cause so when I started all my sessions today, there was some woman that showed up and she was like, oh, you know, I'm so worried about these people. Almost like what well, this outside in my head, almost like borders. Oh, they're going to die in it. Oh, better clean it up. And I'm like, did you die in this? And they're like, no. Oh, uh, her like, sister no. who just passed died away, in it. Her house, her apartment was really cluttered. Was it? Was it almost like a hoarder looking thing? Yes. I mean, not like, yes. And she, yes. oh. Yeah, brought that up, brought, okay, so I would have to say maybe we're talking about the sister and how they're okay. going to die in it that way. I mean, I would also be worried about them too. Yes, yes, keep that there. But she, this person came in before anything and now I just pulled up your appointment and they pop back in my brain. So I bet you're freaking, that's you. Um, So stay with me, stay with me. You already know how I do this. Oh no, I lost you. Where are you at? Are you there? Can you hear me? Okay, there you go. Now you're here. Okay. Hold on. Just stay with me. You already know. All I need you to do is tell me, yeah, Amy, that makes sense. Or no, okay. it doesn't. Okay. And okay. Nicholas, you know, anybody named Nick, just because of my spirit box it just showed up as a Nicholas, but hey, do you know any? No. Okay. Yeah. This is, this is not my control. Maybe it could be somebody else. So stay there. <laughs> Sounds okay. good. Hold, hold on. Come here. What are you doing? Why? but they put her in the hospital when she died. So, um, she was actually, she had passed away on her kitchen floor in her, she passed away in her clutter. Yep. <gasps> that was her. Okay. They go, they go, they go, they took her out of there. They took yes. her out of there. I said, Oh, well, where'd they take her out? And they're talking about having a white sheet over her because they took her body out of there. So, okay. Yes. Let me tell you one thing. I think that her spirit may have showed up to talk about it. They gave me a flash while I was in the shower today, which is weird. <laughs> um, and tell me, Somebody's like denying that they're a hoarder, which means that they are. And um, hold on. Why? She was so stubborn, so stubborn, so stubborn, so stubborn. That's what she just said. It's like, oh, okay. And what about, hold on. I don't know if this is real or if this is a dead animal. Um, So I'm just going to have to figure this out. And do you do... I don't know. You do not have a cat that sits in a window here, correct? Uh, at my house? 
here, where you're at right now? My cat just passed away like a month and a half ago. That's a dead cat. Yes. Okay. Okay. There, somebody just, okay. Somebody I asked just her showed if she me. could come through. Um, it, yep. It's happening. Yeah. <laughs> she goes like this. She goes, oh, kitty. I said, what kitty? And they just, you know, I, you can see the light coming in through the window there. And then they showed me an image. If I were going to look and look that away and they just showed me a, a cat. I don't know if there's even a window still there enough to actually sit in it, but that's just a symbol for me. Oh, there is. Okay. And they have looking outside and I go oh okay so the cat is here okay 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 like in the home and oh. why why oh my kitty 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 you come here it's okay come on here that's the way somebody's talking right now and okay. did yeah did we end up uh why yeah we had to let them go it we did uh, she was uh 17 almost oh um God. and we brought her to the vet because I realized her eye was looking funny and I didn't realize that would be the day that she passed away her uh she had a big ball of cancer and her lungs were really bad oh poor sweetie okay yeah okay so uh, she goes like this. She's telling her to come with her. She's telling her to come to the light. And Aww. so that means it's okay. You're with me. So like she came Aww. down to grab her and bring her home. Oh, and that. that's just, yeah, that's why I was like, oh, I said, was it here? Was it there? And she goes, oh, they had to let it go. But I came to get her. I go, oh, okay. And why? Tell me. Hold on. Who? Mom. 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 Okay. I don't know. Does this go along with like mom's mom or something? Or is it mom? Oh, for um, past. Yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Weird, weird. I don't know why they would make a big deal about mom over and over She's been sick. So. Oh, oh, well, yeah, absolutely then. Yeah, there's like a worry. She just goes, mom. And I go, I'm not hearing any grandma like dealing with that. So I'm like, I don't know why they're, why? Hmm. Interesting. They just gave me an image or a symbol of how your mother condition may be helped by herself so maybe is like mom dealing with a lot of like levels and stuff like that like diabetic or something yeah she has um depression oh and, uh, yes um how things in the last couple of years have really had that uh -huh. deteriorate uh-huh uh yeah they go like this they say oh she can help it she can make it better and I go yes. oh and they go but won't does it help it and I go oh okay and they say like they need to otherwise there's going to be a demise and like we're seeing this here I mean I'm not saying she's dying this month or anything like that right, right? but right. They, yeah, they're just very cut and dry about these things and right. she appreciate she, that. Uh -huh, she why hold on what do you mean by that random guy random guy um did this is so random did like one of your parents lose like a brother early uh i am not sure i don't believe yeah so. Yeah, I know. That's all weird things. Somebody feels like it doesn't feel like you. It feels <laughs> like some man, younger, 40s, maybe, but okay. it's not that they don't know, like they're not connected to you. So I'm like, well, sure. and I have no idea. They just like randomly popped in, but it almost feels like a beside what would be dad or could be going along with dad. Um, so I would even say maybe that could go along with friend but they're not they just popped into like say hi so hold up we're gonna move that over there they're mm -hmm. saying tell me why who are you 
where? Aww. Your kitty's still here. Your kitty just showed me a paw print and a butterfly over and over and over again. And Aww. they talked about you ended up, you did get her cremated? Yes, she's right behind me. You did? Yeah. Okay. She's. Okay. Yeah. I said, where did they put you? I said, did they leave you? Did they bury you or what? And she goes, oh, no. Takes me home. I go, oh, okay, good. And she says that, like, always there, always there. So your kitty's still living here. I love and, that. Uh huh. And they're saying, tell me, random. That's too big for you, though. Um, you don't have a bulldog around you at all, or like a flat face, brachycephalic looking dog. Yeah, I know. There's, I'm just going to put this out here. There is something about a tan and white Boston or a tan and white bulldog or a tan and white Frenchie that keeps showing up over and over again. But it almost feels like it will, they keep showing as in walking into your life. And <laughs> For me, a bulldog is way too big for you. So I would even say maybe it goes down into like Frenchie or something like that. Um, Because right now you do not want a about, dog. Yeah, we've been talking about oh. getting a dog. Yeah. Yeah, I would have to say something going in that direction. I don't know how, or maybe it's like part bulldog that you find. I just, just you'll have to let me know. Okay. okay. Um, And then tell me why, why? Tell me. I don't know. For her sister, um, did we end up, did they find her like two or three days later? Uh, okay. okay. It's been a while. Somebody, uh-huh. I, I think, I think this, um, so this would be like a great aunt for you or like an yes. aunt for you. A uh, great my aunt husband's or, aunt. So my Your husband's aunt. aunt. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So it's a removed aunt. Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah. Cause it just feels like she's not tied directly. So I'm like, maybe there's this one step up and tell me why, what about her? She says, stared at my body for a few days. One, 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 one. Aww. And I go, Oh, okay. And tell me how. Come here. Loves you. Oh, we love her. Oh, both. Yeah, they do. They adore you. They're in heaven. They're in a higher vibrational place. So it's like talking to a firefly right now. That's what it feels like. <laughs> They're like here, then they go, then they come back. And your cat's just chilling in your room with you. And I love that. Uh-huh. What about why? Have you had the girl yet? No, right? I have two girls. You do? Okay, perfect. Okay, yeah, they, they go like this. They go, oh, such a good mom. I said, she's a mom? Really? And then they showed your haircut and then they put it on another little girl. And they <laughs> had them sitting in the sun, like in a room with like sun shining on them. And I go, oh, oh. and they're talking about watching this. And they're talking about how good you are with them. Okay. I love that. And how, and how much they love it and why tell me, hold on, hold on. Hold on. What do you mean? Just an angel. Interesting. So I wonder if an angel is around them all the time. Um, I just said correct right after that. So I'd have to say yes. Yeah, definitely. Um, tell me who, who, Wow. Where? Where is this at? Somebody is trying to make me feel them slipping away, but I'm not getting any other information but that. So hold on. Come here. Tell me about you. What happened? What? Okay. Are y'all going? 
I don't know if this happened or if this is happening. Um, they put you in like, are you taking them to Disneyland? They keep talking about Disneyland, but my oldest daughter does dance and we're going to a national dance competition this year. So they were pretty bummed about that. <laughs> but, but a couple of years. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. They go like this. They go, um, they put you and they put your two girls and they put a partner and they had made all of y'all have little backpacks on <laughs> and they had you hold hands. Aww. And I go, what is this? And they go Disneyland or Disney World, whichever one it would be. And they go, they oh, love they Disney. won. Uh huh. And so, and they put you in these little pedal pusher shorts or something like that. And I go, oh, okay. It's very fitting. I like it. And they're talking about how, tell me, Hold on. Where? Uh, do you know if like a dance competition is odd? Oh, do you have anything to do in Utah? Uh, no, not not this. Or year. like, okay, leave that there. Yeah, because they they somebody went like this. They went East Coast, like North Carolina, something South Carolina. like. South Carolina, really? Yeah, okay. They put me there and then they went, whoop, Utah. And I go, I don't know. Um, okay, so they're talking about that. So uh, also another thing, um, Holman, why? What? Idaho. No, there's nothing up there. Stop it. Who is talking about that? Ah, uh, they're wanting me to look up something over there, but it doesn't, nothing hit. So we're going to leave that there. That may be somebody for my next session. So stay over there. Um, Cause they just showed me Idaho and Utah, which are like, you know, right next to one another, essentially. Um, let me see, come move that over there. Tell me, come here. What happened with you? She don't want to talk about passing. She just goes, I'm here. I'm here. I found, I love, I love. That's all she keeps saying. And she's like having a good time. I, when she passed, did she end up like, were y'all not there with her when she crossed over? His aunt? Yeah. Yeah. No. Or like, uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. She just says, she goes, oh, I was in the dark and now I see. And I go, oh my God. Okay. And she's very light, very bright, very airy. And what? Tell me. Hold on. Come here. What, what, what? And so then your dad's mom is crossed? Yes. Okay. Interesting. Sorry. There was somebody who just said my son. And I go, Oh, who's your son? And they <laughs> talk about how it's like your dad. I go, Oh, okay. And why? Hold on. Cause she'd be old, wouldn't she? Uh, very, very old. Hold on. Is your dad in his like late 60s right now? his early 60s he's early 60s okay interesting somebody goes like this they go my son is getting up there i said what do you mean he's getting up there i said how old is he right now and my dad was 86 when i was 29 and so i go is he that age and she goes no 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 no, no 60s and she puts old though so i'm like maybe late 60s and okay. she says that uh-huh she says tell me why Maybe he's um, having to better sooner than later. If he starts focusing on heart health, that would be good. Um, please, that would be great. Um, 74 is a number for him. I don't yeah. know why. 74 is a big number for him. So maybe something big happens then, or maybe like something happens around them, but they keep bringing up 74. Yeah. And it may be something related going on here. So we'll just have to see. Um and they're talking about how, why, where, random, mm. and your daughter's going to be in dance next year again? Both of them are. Interesting. Yeah. I wonder if there's going to be a competition in Houston or something like that for you. That's funny that you uh, say that. It's, she does it every other year in like Houston. <laughs> okay, that's why.
Okay. Yeah, they go like this. They just showed me um, MD Anderson Cancer Center. I'm from Houston originally. Um, and they keep showing me the rodeo. And I go, what are you doing? Do they live there? And they go, no. And they go, dance, kids. I go, what do you mean dance, kids? How does that work? And they go, Houston. And I go, oh, okay. And they're like saying that y'all are going to be traveling there at some point. And I go, oh, okay, well, that's fine. Uh-huh. So they're going to be going with you. And like they're that. saying, mm -hmm. they're saying what? Tell me about her. <gasps> oh, Ooh, do you get a hernia? Did you get a hernia? Do you have a hernia? Uh, from pregnancy, yes. It's kind of. Oh, okay. Why don't you get it fixed? Is it like like an equal or is it like belly button? Where is it at? Uh, it, it wasn't really ever followed up on and nothing that ever has oh. bothered me. So nothing I've ever checked out. Okay, so very random. You may start to have pain from that, or there may be something bigger that happens with that coming up in the near future. You're, you're not dying from a hernia or anything like that. Um, okay. But I actually have never met anybody else that has had a hernia from pregnancy. I had one, and I had to get it all fixed. So um, keep that in the back of your brain, okay? Or sure. I just say at the front of your brain. Um, and they're saying, tell me, what, 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 what? Oh, my head just hurt. Um, hold on. Okay. Just because it's happening in my brain right here. Um, do you know anybody on either your side or your partner's side that one of that somebody had an aneurysm? Yes. Is who is that? His grandma. Really? Literally made my brain hurt. You saw my, I saw my eyes go like that. It just went bop, bop when I second guessed it. Wow. That was amazing. She made it hurt really bad. That's why I poked myself in the head. Um, why? She says, I'm fine now. I go, I, I know you're fine now. I know you're great. Um, why? What do you mean had them all? Does he have like four brothers and sisters or something? Does he have like four kids in his household or something? Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. Uh, he only has a sister, but his grandma had like four or five kids. Four or five kids. Okay. She goes, I took their care of them all and I go oh okay and she's essentially saying like they were a bigger headache than that and I go oh okay well that's fine but she loves them um and she likes them and she says that tell me what oh hold on let me take a screenshot hold on that's cute good job spirit box good job y'all hang on let me go and find oh it won't be able to go anyways it says she loves you <laughs> that's sweet there you I go oh uh -huh. there's a lot of love good job and hey hold on who was she living with who was with her when that happened his grandma or his yeah his grandma i am yeah exactly like totally sure of the backstory okay okay it's okay she goes like this she goes they found me and I said what do you mean I said this is at home this is at a hospital or what and they say it's at home um or it's like more like uh in, in a comfortable area but then they're talking about I guess people trying to bring her back but like nobody can make it work because I guess it already gone all the way through mm -hmm. and why and her house is gone, so none of the parents or anything like that live in her house or anything, or her place where she lived? It was so old. Oh, okay, okay. She goes, I died there. And I go, what? She says, oh, it's gone. Oh, okay. And why? Tell me. She's fine. That's so what she keeps saying. She goes, I'm fine. I'm fine. I go, I know. And tell me about her. Hold on. Oh. Weird. I don't know if you do. Maybe you do do this. Um, are you like a person that likes to do Christmas cookies? 
Yeah, you're one of those people. I like you. I found my prayer. I, I can't do them because my hand shakes too much, but I appreciate people that do. And they just brought that okay. up. Uh-huh. That's what they said. They go, oh, they're so beautiful. And you're like, oh, they're not that good. I was like, yes, she is Virgo. I know that's where it's at. And they're talking about making it a, like a, a family tradition or something. Um, but maybe the girls aren't necessarily, wait, so one of them is really into it, but the other one, not so much. Yes. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. I said, are they both? And so I'm asking them to put the picture and one's like, and the other one's, so like, yeah. it's, it's both in there. Mm -hmm. And he says that, tell me, oh, I don't know. Ain't no way. You're not old enough for that. You have a 12 year old. How old do you have? What, what say, what age do you have? They're seven and four. They are. Oh, okay, good. I was like, you can't have a 12 year old. You're not that old yet. See? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So she goes like this. She goes, one of them is a diva. Huh. And I go, oh, okay. So that must be a 12 year old, right? That. And um, she yeah, says well. that, oh, that we're going to leave that there then. Yeah. And tell me, what about her? Oh, wow. She just had one of them. I know you said you're doing dance. Um, is she going to be doing like gymnastics dance as well? My youngest loves gymnastics and she just really for dance too. Mm, okay, good. Yeah. They had her on a springboard and then made her like yeah. do a landing. Okay. They, they go, love okay. They, especially my youngest. Uh, she loves that. Right please continue. I think it could be really, really good for them. And she could be very successful if, if you push that more, which would be great. Okay. And there, she's talking about why, what about you? Who are you? New spirit just entered my brain. Oh, my God. who are you? I don't know. They're trying to figure out what, I don't know. Is this how I may get this wrong? Is you're in a house right now. You're not in an apartment though, correct? Okay. Is it from the 60s? I believe so. Either that or the 70s, around that time period. Really? Fascinating. Okay. The ranch. <laughs> oh, I have, well, we can, well, yeah, we'll figure that out. There's some guy that just showed up. And he says, I'm in the home. I said, what do you mean you're in the home? I said, this is a brand new home. And he goes, he goes, no, it's not. And I said, it looks like it as I'm looking around. And then I said, when was this built then? And then he went and he put, um, uh, he made me hear Sunny and Cher. And then he put like those bright floral, like psychedelic patterns or whatever it is. And okay. the block. The Black Room with White Curtain song, which I think was made in like 69 or something like that. Um, so I don't know. I mean, your house isn't haunted by any means, but there may be a, a spooky little past owner rolling around in here somewhere to just pop in and say hi, um, gotcha. uh, which which can be a thing. Um, like that would make wow. sense. Like occasionally the light would turn on or something. Yes. Yes. Oh, how cool. Okay. And does this home have a like decent sized foyer or like entrance to it or something? Yes. Oh, okay. And he goes like this. He says, welcome, welcome, come in. <laughs> I go, oh, okay. Um, the smaller house overall, but like the entryway is. The bigger. entryway is decent. Yeah. Oh, how interesting. Yeah. I have to say maybe you have a past um, gentleman that wow. used to live here or like okay. even like the first one now mind you it's never bad they're they're not stuck here but they do they have a lot of good memories you know makes sense and that's okay you would come back for a little bit right. um and why tell me whoa whoa what hold on what do you mean i don't know what that means Um, so is your home on like two acres or something like that? It's 
So the home itself isn't, but um, so we have like a regular sized yard, but it's oh. open and it goes to the school behind us, which has a lot of land. A huge. Oh, yes. okay. Yeah. They go like this. They said, oh, this is her home. Oh, but it's a part of this large piece of land. And I go, okay, so maybe it's two acres out of like 60 or something. No, it's two yes. acres. Okay. Gotcha. And they're talking about how, tell me come here what about it what is that I don't know what that means um do we have some bodies like tiny <sighs> I'm gonna say it's like small no do you wear gold? You wear pearls a lot, or something, or do you wear like pearl earrings at all, or yes, like little? I'm wearing them right now. Oh, you're wearing fucking pearls right now. Okay, okay, but you don't have any of theirs, though, correct? <laughs> okay, yeah, they're making me feel the ball of a pearl with a gold backing to it, and I go, "What is this?" And they keep showing me gold over and over again. But like, so I yeah. keep um, her earrings that she gave me, and one of the backings is like a ball type. And I don't ever touch them. And the girls can play with everything but those because they're just so special to me. But those, okay, yes, okay, yeah. Like make me feel the ball of it. I'm like, I don't know what this is. Maybe it's a pearl, I don't know. <laughs> um, okay, good. So she's like recognizing that and wanting you to know that she knows and like she's she's here and she's around, okay? Um, yeah, she's in heaven. You have some very cool people that just decide to like all show up at the same time. Like you're like- I love them, yeah. Yeah, they're very cool. I like that you're open. I like the way you feel. Um, and and they're always around. And oh, huh? Uh, was there something recently going on with your car? Was like your check engine light on or something? And you got really? It was on, and then it just randomly turned off. <sighs> Okay, there you go. <laughs> they made me feel your exact expression of. Okay. All right. We got to go get this. Oh, okay. Just a little bit. Oh, it's fine. Yes. Okay. So yeah. So know that they know they're around. Okay. So okay. this is what I want you to do because I have to run up my next session. I just realized I'm 10 minutes late. So um, if, or seven minutes late, if you have questions for me, or if you okay. need me, email me. Okay. Okay. And then the other thing I want you to do is you had a whole party show up for this. So I want you to tell each one of these people you love them. I love okay. You thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Tell them thank you for coming through. And also, can you, I mean, I don't know if they're really, really worried about like the aunt that passed suddenly, like in her hoarding area, but I mean, give them messages, let them know that she's okay. I will. Absolutely. Okay. Okay. All right, my friend. Thank I love you so you. much. I really appreciate it. Anytime, thank you. Honey. I Bye, love baby. You.